Welcome, gentlemen. Thanks. Your film, Dandelions. Tell me about it. Well, Dandelions is a personal cinema verite documentary. I received a Facebook message from two teens in Russia, and they claimed that they were my siblings and that we shared the same father. And I thought it was a complete scam. And then I realized when they sent me photos that it wasn't. And it took me eight years to integrate this truth. And eventually um, I was like, okay, I'm gonna tell my family. So I started with my brother. So I asked Ben to come over my house one day and I said, hey, I'm gonna do a project and we're both gonna be in it. And so he shows up and I tell him the truth about this family secret that I learned. So yeah, that's how the film starts. Did they look like you? Is that is the photos told you? Or? I, well, I saw photos of me as a, a little baby, photo, like photos I'd never seen before actually. My mom married to a man I'd never seen before. Oh, so they had a lot of real proof. Yeah, oh yeah. Goodness. So it was a complete, uh, you know, it was a secret that I found out about through Facebook. And so the, the film is a journey about going to Russia to find them and to learn about why we had this family secret in our family. Ben, when Basil told you about that, how did that make you feel? You know, when people ask me that, I just I say I blacked out, to be honest. Uh -huh. It was fun for me to rewatch it because I it was just all a blur. Um, like the ceiling was falling down, not in a bad way, like the sky was falling down, not as if I was scared or anything, but just like someone just took the wind out of you and you can't catch any air, you know, processing who are we? Are we brothers or is this, what does half mean? Is, is half less than full? You know, all of these questions came flooding and actually very quickly I made the decision right there to say, you know what, I don't care about that word. You know, you are my brother. And we got that, you know, clear from the start before we even went to Russia. So, yeah. Well, as you came to terms with it, uh, was that a challenge then to go ahead and make the film or was the film cathartic? Yeah, the film was definitely cathartic. The entire thing, once we, you know, open up that, the genie came out of the bottle and we said, okay, we're going to go to Russia and do this. There was no stopping it. And so we go and, and we track down, find my biological dad. We found my grandmother on my paternal side that hadn't seen me in 29 years. So I'm meeting people from the family. Ben is there supporting me. And yeah, so the whole experience was completely cathartic. But at least you had each other on the journey. That, that must have been very helpful. I, sometimes I wondered if I was supposed to be there, but I think multiple times on a daily basis, you would pull me to the side and say, I don't know what I would do if you weren't here. So that gave me purpose every day. Because yeah. sometimes I felt a little bit like I was on the side, you know, but then when we would finish or we'd have a private moment and either maybe you would just finish having an emotional moment and you would tell me you mean so much to me you're helping me so much right now that gave me more energy to keep going and it was it was cathartic but during it was also very tenuous and, and strange and scary and just a lot, you know, a well, lot of emotions. You, you really supported me with your music too. That was a that was a big thing for me because Ben did the original score in the entire film, so oh he's doing goodness. that live. Wow. Well, it sounds like a fabulous film. What would you like audiences to take away from it? I think that for audiences who watch Dandelions, that we hope that it's an inspiration, an inspiration for people to be really transparent with their families, because for us, making the film and being able to screen it to our parents was a really healing moment, and it's the point where cinema for me became medicine and not just storytelling, because it really released a lot of fears in our family, that kind of transparency and openness. So we hope that people get inspired to uh, have those kind of transparent conversations with their families because that's what matters, family. So important. How does it feel to have your film here at the Santa Barbara International Film Festival? We're stoked. Yes, <laughs> yes. it's an honor. Yeah. Well, yeah. thank you so much, gentlemen. Congratulations thank for you. your journey, and we're so glad to have you. Thank you so much.